Hi everyone, I hope you're safe and well. Today we're going to be doing a collage project and we are going to be focusing on the work of Joanna Goodman and Hannah Hawk. Our goal is to create a collage using the images you used last week in the style of Joanna Goodman. Hannah Hawk was a German artist working in Berlin around the 1920s to the 1960s. She's one of the most important collage artists of the 20th century. She really stood her ground in an art world dominated by men. Her work has had an impact in her time and in the years afterwards. During the Dada period, she made art that criticized the seriousness of society. It showed the fragmented state of the world around her. She also questions ideas around beauty and women. Here we see the body of an infant with the face of a mask and an eye of a woman. The red piece is a work by Hannah Hock, and the piece on the right with the snakes is a piece by contemporary collage artist Joanna Goodman. I can see similarities in Hannah Hawke's and Joanna Goodman's work. Like Hawke, Goodman plays with the proportions of the body. She also places the figure in dreamlike settings. Take a moment to notice the similarities and the differences. This is a work by Joanna Goodman. It's called State of Unease. The title helps us to understand what the work is about. In the image, you can see a doctor or a nurse where the body is created using different textures that you might find in a hospital, specifically gowns and masks, which are a current issue for the NHS, for example. You can also see the figure holding its hands in a sort of prayer-like position, almost as if the figure is asking for help. Like Hannah Hawk, Joanna Goodman is responding to the world around her. So now I'd like for you to have a go at making a collage inspired by Joanna Goodman and Hannah Hawk. I'd like you to cut the shape of a body using the images you took for Aaron Siskine. The reason I'm asking you to use these images is because I want you to practice developing your work, taking one idea and developing it into an, a new idea using different processes and materials. I'd like you to place hands, feet, and a head onto the body that you've created, and then place that figure onto a background of your choice. Some things to consider are, how does your work play with the proportions of the body? It, it would be a good idea for you to have a look at some of Joanna Goodman's work to see how she uses the textures in her compositions. Next. What story does your collage tell? Lastly, how does your collage relate to the world around you? Here is an example I made earlier. I took the images of my texture, the coins, and then I, I cut it into the shape of a body and then placed the head, the arms, the feet, and then I placed it onto a background. So I'm not going to be prescriptive about how you make your collage. It's completely up to you. You can print images, you can use newspapers, magazines, um, and just manually stick things together. Or you can use apps, for example. Um, and also, most of you will have access to Photoshop. You can use Photoshop. Um, just look up some tutorials online, put in collage, uh, Photoshop into, into YouTube, and there are several options there. Okay, good luck.